How smart are you on your salt intake? What happens is the moment a doctor tells you you got a blood pressure or you got a heart problem, doctor also tells you be careful on your salt. He will tell you start eating lesser salt. But many times people are over smart. They say, oh, doctors told me to reduce the salt. I'll say that I can eat without salt. What happens then? First of all, you are eating an absolutely tasteless food. There is no need for that. Second, what happens is you end up in taking no salt. Our whole body runs on salt in the right perspective. If that becomes less, we have a problem. If that becomes more, we have a problem. In Goa or in India, we have a hot, humid climate and you tend to sweat quite a lot even if you don't go out, whether it's invisible sweat or whether it's visible sweat. Sometimes we sweat up to 1 litre to 1.5 litres a day. Have you ever tasted your sweat? It is salty. It means you are losing salt in your sweat and whatever you are using has to be replaced back. We need at least 5 grams of salt a day, which is one teaspoonful. And if you don't take any salt, besides your tasteless food, you will be having lack of salt in your body. And it happens. Today we easily can make a, do a salt test. When any patient comes into my casualty and I get a call, the first thing I, before I reach there, I tell them to taste the salt. And last few years, what I find is 10 to 15% of these people are just having less salt in their blood. If your salt reduces, you will start getting a headache, you will talk irrational, you, you can throw a convulsion or you can even become unconscious and go into coma. Salt is essential for us. All that I do, look at the report, give them salt and if, I, if the patient has been brought to the hospital in time, what happens is he becomes alright immediately and goes home. Then I have to explain to him what went wrong and how to take care of it. But still, somebody in the neighborhood, some elderly people will tell, oh, you got blood pressure, you must eat food without salt. Absolutely wrong. So we must be able to take those 5 grams of salt that we need and I'm telling you, then we will live a completely normal good life. So whatever is your state of blood pressure, eat a tasty food with normal salt. Don't add additional salt to it. Don't take things which have more salt like salted nuts, salted groundnuts and all salted biscuits. Those definitely you should avoid. And once in a while, as you check your blood pressure, as you check your cholesterol, at that time also check your salt so that you are sure of what are you consuming. You are sure whether your body salt is normal or no. And with this little precaution, I am sure you can live a great and long life. Thank you so much.